to the Industry of Things World 2015 here in Berlin. It's my pleasure to be here with Dave Raggett from W3C. Hi Dave. Hi. Um, you're heading up the Web of Things group at the uh, W3C. Can you tell us a little bit about the goals and mission of this group? Okay, first a small correction. I'm the technical lead, but I'm not heading up. Okay. I'll explain that in a minute. Excellent. So W3C, we are uh, obviously we've been around and working web technologies for many years. And we, we've worked on the web of pages, and so we're now looking to apply web technologies more generally to the web of things. Mm -hmm. So we had a workshop here in Berlin a year ago, mm -hmm. and we have an interest group which was launched at the beginning of this year. And that's uh, actually chaired by uh, Jörg Ahoyer from Siemens in okay. Munich. Right. And we're also starting to prepare work on the grounds for standardization for a working group. We have to launch later. What does the concept of standard really mean in the context of IoT? Okay. Well, at the moment, I think the IoT is suffering because it's, uh, it's immature, it's very fragmented, mm -hmm. lots of silos. And in some ways, the web had it easy because at the beginning of the web, it, was, it wasn't very commercial. Mm -hmm. So people just get on collaborating, building stuff. And people say, oh, I like the web, I'll, I'll implement a web server mm -hmm. or whatever. Yeah. But now this is a little too commercial, so everybody's trying to do their own thing and they're pulling in different directions. Mm -hmm. This is making it much more expensive and riskier to invest in. So in particular, um, if you have people uh, to develop something, mm -hmm. it's kind of more like a one-off or a custom, yeah. and they need their skills, they move with their skills, you know, yeah. they uh, move on to other jobs or run over by parcel, let's hope not, and yeah. sort of things. So that's, uh, right now, I think that uh, it's a lack of standards, mm -hmm. which will give that continuity, a pool of developers, yeah. continuity of knowledge, yeah. reduce the costs, availability of tools, mm -hmm. and so on open up the markets. Yeah. So there are currently um, um, some uh, initiatives in place. Um, which standards do you foresee emerging like out of this? Um, oh, okay, so well, the W3C, we're, what we're thinking about is how to connect up all these different IoT platforms. We realize that different platforms are going to be here with us for a while, mm -hmm. just like they are for the web. Yeah. And uh, people will need to use different protocols. It won't be like a protocol like HTTP will do it all. Mm -hmm. There's going to be different protocols mm -hmm. for different purposes. So how do you build a, uh, a distributed system and simplify it for the developers? We'd like to make it easy for people like web developers mm -hmm. who are very familiar with scripting and web, web APIs and so on. So the idea is to create an abstraction layer which sits above the platforms. Mm -hmm. And for that to work, we have to do uh, kind of a lot of work around uh, shared semantics mm -hmm. and rich metadata. And that's, that's key to interoperability and also for discovery. Um, regarding threats, what do you think the greatest threat is to the Internet of Things? Um, in terms of security and privacy? Okay. Well, right now, it, it obviously, there are a lot of stories about the, uh, the security issues. So, um, in W3C, you know, we think it should be secure, and uh, we're launching new groups to, to work on uh, strong authentication mm -hmm. and uh, secure hardware. And in particular, we want to sort of separate off the authentication and identity piece and, and trust piece. Yeah. So, we think there's a lot to be done, mm -hmm. and I think that people talk about uh, the IoT devices being too low powered. Mm -hmm. I don't think that's really true anymore. I think that although the individual components might be quite low power, mm -hmm. there's now available very cheap chips which can accelerate the, uh, uh, do hardware acceleration mm -hmm. and uh, provide the level of security that's needed. Yeah. From, um, from here and now, would you say um, the um, conference format um, works for you or any feedback that you want to give to the organizers? Uh, so far, it's worked great. I, I, unfortunately, I missed out on the uh, the round ta the um, tables at lunchtime. It's been a good time so far. Yes, uh -huh. a lot of contacts, a lot of talking to people. We'll have a great discussion later on. Uh, thanks for coming to yes, us welcome. and um, have Thank a great you. conference. Thanks. Thanks.